Okay, so many comments of people that don't or have this giant distaste for the, someone that they are supposed to be their twin. And it's weird. It's just kind of like, well, why do you, you know, what's going on here? It's like, I hate them. I want nothing to do with them. All right. All right. So, you know, maybe, maybe they're a false twin. No, 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 great, that, that, that makes so much sense, makes so much sense, you, you have no love for this person, and yet, you, and you don't want to be with them, and you're giving up on them, um, why, why do you think that, they're your twin again? I don't understand. And it's like, so you have two options here, right? Option A is your true twin is, uh, is you. You are the same. You are one energy. So in order for you to not love them, not have any love for your, your twin flame, then you have no love for yourself. That's option A. Option B is this person is, I really have no desire to be with them and you know, they, they don't treat me how I want to be treated and they don't, uh, they don't give me, uh, you know, they don't, they don't provide me, you know, anything that I'm looking for at all. And so maybe they're my false twin. You know, that's, that's option B. There's two of them. Option A, option B. So how do you know? How do you know which one is which, right? Because your false twin is going to regularly abandon you over and over and over again. You know, that this person, you know, will not want to spend long periods of time with you. And uh, they will also find any way possible to get away from you emotionally or physically. Um, they're essentially like using you uh, for what they need. And then once they get what they need, they're out. Right? Um, this could be a pattern. Uh, this is, this, this could be something that you've experienced as a pattern throughout your life. And that's why, uh, it's occurring again. Um, but they will also try to lie to you about who they really are, right? Because, um, if you find out that you're, they're your false twin, or you find out that this isn't, uh, as real as you think it is, then you're going to stop giving them the love that they're taking from you. They're freely taking from you. Uh, they're going to hide their true self. They're going to hide their motives. They're going to, uh, you know, they don't want you to find them out. And this is a very surface level relationship where, um, you might be diving in wholeheartedly and sharing all that you are. Uh, and that by that, I mean, you know, sharing all the love you have, but they aren't. And they are very specific about not doing that. You know, that's, that's goes along uh, the same lines as, as they, you know, they don't, they want to get away as much as possible emotionally and physically because they don't want you to, uh, realize that they aren't giving you anything, that they're just taking all that you're giving them and then they're hitting the road once they, once they get their fill. And then when, when, you know, that 
uh, energy dissipates within them, then they come back looking for more. And there you are, you know, just giving it and, you know, they take it and run. That's the cycle. Um, also, like, they, they like, uh, you know, they string you along in this way. And they're, they're keeping you on the hook. Right? They're, they're uh, giving you just enough for you to uh, keep providing them with all the love they need. Right? Just as soon as, like, you, you'll notice, uh, as soon as, like, you, you know, put your foot down or whatever, and you're like, oh, screw this. I'm, I'm not doing this anymore. Like, they show up, and they're like, oh, come on. Like, I'm sorry. And then, you know, you buy it, and then you just start pouring pouring love. And, you know, they, they take all they can, and then they're out again. And cycle, 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 right? And they'll never like want to share the deepest parts of themselves, right? So as you as you want to grow and expand your relationship, um, they never want to do that. That's something that is completely uh, not in their in their game plan of how they they're going to uh, proceed with this relationship with you. This is not something that. Um, they want to do because they don't share your values. They don't share your deepest values and they know that. And in order for them to uh, keep, keep getting what it is that you're giving them, uh, if they were to share your, their values with you, you would notice right away, you would know right away that this isn't the person and uh, it would be over. So, all of that is, you know, smoke and mirrors, and it's just uh, deceit uh, that they're that they're uh, showing you in order to get what it is that you're giving. Uh, and they certainly don't want you like uh, to to heal and and go deeper within yourself uh, because this is, you know, you're at if you're down here um, and you're giving all of the all of yourself to them. Um, once you start leveling up and healing yourself, you're going to realize that they're a fraud and you're going to stop that. So they, they don't want any of that. They want to keep you uh, where you're at and the status quo, right? And uh, like, so it's, it's basically like feeling yourself, uh, feeling within yourself like, you know, what? What kind of, what is the, who is this person? You know, they don't want like, um, they don't want any, anything to do with me except when they want it. And, and they, they, they have no uh, commitment to me and there's no like loyalty. And, I, and I've like shared all of myself with this person. And I, I don't know if I really know them at all. You know, I don't, I don't really recall them sharing anything with me. Um, so like what gives, right? So that's like, so it's your determination is like feel in your heart, right? Is this person regardless of how, of what the actions that are being shown to you, regardless if they're pissing you off or making you sad or, or you're hurt by them or whatever, are they, are those things, um, causing you to expand the love for yourself or are they not you know you can feel when somebody is just taking 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 and not giving at all and whether somebody is doing the things that they're doing in order to reveal to you where your upsets are causing you not to be in alignment with loving yourself you can make that distinction and when you do make that distinction, you'll realize who, if you're really with your true twin or not, or if this is a false twin. And that's something that, uh, you know, you take a good, hard, lock, hard, long look at it and really uh, determine your deepest core values. And that's one of the uh, 
free lessons on my e-course is determining your your deepest core values because your core values line up perfectly with your twin flame and those same core values are not at all in comparison with a false twin and they don't want you to know that because like i said they'll know you'll know right away that they're not they're not the one so um hopefully this like brings some clarity into uh, whether or not you you are with your twin flame or with a with a false twin and you know check the description box down below for the links to coaching and my e-course um, you know and also uh, leave a comment down below and uh, do some self-discovery and, and really uh, be clear on yourself you know what's what's really going on in your life and I will talk to you later